Hello guys. Hi. How are you doing? Good, good, good. How are you guys? So good. could you tell me more about the Art Directors Guild? The Art Directors Guild? It is a union that represents production designers, art directors, graphic artists, illustrators, map artists, model makers, scenic artists, set designers, title artists, and pre-visual artists. Everything that's on this for sure. So it's pretty much people that help design a concept for a film and um, make it a reality. Oh, perfect. Mm -hmm. So you guys working on uh, like current uh, films that are coming up or? Us personally? Yeah. No, because we're oh. here. Right, right, right. But in the future, are you guys working we on like to. big films? We hope, we hope to, but we're not at liberty to say because we don't know. Oh, you don't know yet? Okay. No. That could, that could change tomorrow. My phone's ringing by the night that I'll, I'll be out of here. Oh, yeah? yeah. Oh, is so, it so you guys work on the yeah. Yeah. concrete? Yeah. You, would be, you would be absolutely amazed the number of like productions, film productions that are happening around us. I mean, right in, LA. Now. in LA, it's unbelievable. Wow. I mean, a lot of things that we're, we're obviously a lot of times the public don't know about it, about what's going on. Mm -hmm. We might have information, but sometimes it might not be at liberty to share that too. Oh yeah, right. there is plenty of times where I've lied to people about what I'm doing, making the Manny's commercial or something. That's oh, okay. True. Got you. Yeah. yeah. And uh, is, is the industry changing because of like, you know, streaming services are coming up today? Yeah, everything. It's how... so quickly. Yeah. The biggest change I've noticed is the amount of time you get to, to make something or get it ready to prepare it. Um, it's been slashed in half because, I mean, not to age anybody, but like right. in the 90s and stuff, people used Polaroids and payphones to gotcha. communicate and like, uh -huh. show yeah. options. And now I just have a little computer in my pocket and I can take a picture of something I see and say, let's get 10 of these, go right. to the nearest store and get this for me, you know? So because we can inf like exchange information so quickly, okay. I think that it's been a big benefit, but it's a huge hindrance now because it we just don't have advice. It makes it much more competitive too. Because yeah. Because we have like, so many, like all the streaming services. Like, right. For instance, so, you know, you... I was, I, was, I, was, I was running, I was out on the trail running, and I, I literally got stopped on my run because Netflix were doing a, working on a show, you know, right in their head. And it didn't, look, it didn't have anything, they had like, they had a drone overhead, they were filming with a drone, you know, and so it's all this technology which has become so much more affordable. Right. Rather than have to hold all these trucks of equipment, mm -hmm. they can do these pr productions a lot, uh, less expensively. Right. Yeah. yeah. And it's quicker, huh? Yeah. It's a lot quicker. It's a good and bad thing. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's a good and bad thing. But is, is there a trade-off for, t uh, like, quality of the uh, I don't think so. image? But I think that the, the quality is only really... I mean, those of us who have been around for a long time have actually worked in the film. You can see the difference between the film and the film. Yeah. So, yeah. And now, you know, people are shooting stuff on smaller devices. Right. The quality is like, and with 4K and right. 5K and whatever, it's just... But counteracting yeah. that, because of HD, you can see a lot more now, too. I can see someone's like... A couple of people like usually near the stage are starting to... Okay. Just, you know, for when it's, when it's sessions over. I know exactly where it is. That was Picard. Yeah. Well, even like, you know, something like this, I think Apple's coming out with like new camera software where you can have two, three cameras and basically they could zoom in and out depending on where you are. Yeah. Which because is. The thing is, is that like people are making their own content now. Right. It's so great at the same time because, you know, you can just set up a bunch of cameras and they're all going to be in front of anything. Right. And make something that someone's willing to watch. There's just so much to see now. Right. So it's like... Which is great in some ways because for, for your generation, I mean, you can all this tools. Right. You can go create a film. I mean, it doesn't take much to do that, you know? I mean, it's it just going to be all the level quality. Right. Yeah. It's the stuff that you can go somewhere with. You know? yeah. Independent filmmaking. I mean, independent films are amazing these days. Right. Especially a lot of documentaries that are on the rise too. People are just making documentaries. Exactly. Like yeah. But anyways, guys, thank you yeah, very thank much. You. Yeah. Hopefully we'll stop by. And you guys are here all three days. Yeah. Same corner. Yeah. That's wonderful.